failed to determine content classification. What the fuck does that mean? Good morning. There was no standby, by the way. Fresh haircut. I got a haircut a while ago. But yes, thank you for noticing. I'm just, I just literally turned on stream. I didn't even go standby. That's why I'm awkwardly standing here. Uh, one sec. Okay, I just posted on Discord and the, the community tab and Twitter. There we go. Hey, good, good morning, guys. I couldn't sleep. Our sleep schedule's fucked right now. I got two ads for BWS. What the fuck is BWS? It's early. Hopefully my camera's not cursed. I got myself a, um... What you call it? A, um... Dummy battery? So if the USB fails, it'll go to backup power now. So, that's good. Um, all right, let's chill. Uh, we got some time. Actually got quite a bit of time. Do we have, um, wait, can you hear music? If I play music, I think I have a Spotify thing that doesn't go to the VOD. Because we just got a bit of time to kill before it starts. You can hear that, right? Oops. Groovy. Oh, I'm too fucking tired, dude. I'll show you what I've been working on, I guess. Been working on this drawing. Oh, it's pretty much done. I was just drawing Gooey. I got um, a mighty need to doodle Pura. Let's see, uh, we got 30 minutes. I've got the direct open. What's the odds of Odyssey 2? I would be shocked. Not, not expecting it. Not expecting it at all, dude. I think, uh, I think the likelihood is it's going to be a bunch of uh, new Mario re-releases, HD, fuck you, whatever. Like, 
I don't know. <clears throat> what I'm trying to say is I'm 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 a doubter. I'm a doubter. Super duper Mario Deluxe uh you yeah probably probably I'm a draw I wanna draw Pura. I've always wanted to draw her, but I never I've never had the chance. Custom Robo. When's it starting? We've got like 30 minutes. We're just chilling right now. Ooh, I mean, yeah, I, I would like Tomodachi Life to come back, mainly just because of Miis. I feel like Miis have become redundant, and Miitopia had a really fucking sweet goddamn system for uh, uh, me creation. That shit blew my mind. I was just like, this is so fun. I had a very fun time with it. Slime done. Thank you, guys. <clears throat> I I'm trying to doodle a, a, a Pura. While I wait for the direct, FYI. I'm a sleepy boy, but I have a mighty, mighty need to draw right now. Dude, Metopia was so fun. That was a great stream. What the fuck? Oh, shrink selection. What the fuck? How did I select that? No, dude, this is Clip. I pretty much primarily use Clip nowadays. I'm probably planning on using it for animation as well soon. Kind of a mix of uh, Toon Boom and Clip. I like roughing out animations in uh, Toon Boom. I don't know why, but something about the lines, surprisingly, I really enjoy. starts in 30 minutes guys we just chilling actually even less than well about 30 minutes is this a normal pure or patreon exclusive pura oh that is a uh, well hmm considering 
I don't do that, but, uh... <laughs> the answer is, uh, it, it's exclusive for you. drawing I'm drawing Pura right now it's just she doesn't look like Pura yet because I'm trying to figure out the haircut that's the hardest part she's got like a headband like under her hair so it's like There we go. It started? No, it hasn't. What? I have it right here. Well, it's live, but it's not, it hasn't started. It doesn't start for like another 30 minutes. Seven AM PT. Yeah, it's, dude, it's, it's that's, that's like, it's it's you're you're not wrong. The stream did start, but is it actually broadcasting anything? No, sir. No, sir. It is not. I missed I, I'm, I'm very behind because everyone else did really badass pure fan art and I, I I never got on the train glad you could catch a stream before work I'm glad you could make it zoom in. I forget how big my tablet is. It looks so small on stream, but it, to me it looks enormous. Thoughts on 2D animation in Blender? Uh, yeah, no. The grease pencil's awesome. Uh, definitely, if that's something you want to try, fucking do it, dude. the the thing on her head go it's like a like a mask sunglass mask looking ass thing it's like 
feel like she doesn't look like her without the glasses. It's kind of crazy. Wow, she really needs it. They're goggles. It's kind of funny. She's got goggles, but then she's got glasses on top of goggles. Oh, I think I feel a spider on my foot. Are there more spiders in my fucking house? Please, please no. I'm done. I'm done. <sighs> nope. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just fucking paranoid at this point. After the last stream, oh my god. I have to put that VOD up. That was just fucking batshit crazy. Now the biggest challenge of all, drawing a star call. Stand up, Bob, thank you. Oh, thank you for those gifted subs. Thank you, stand up here. You move three, thank you. Star Trek stream last night was fun. Yeah, I had a good time. I haven't played that game in ages. Shame they don't really support it anymore because it's a fucking fun game. But dude, it had so many problems. When we were trying to set that shit up, it was insane. It's like sound problems after like, just, oh my God, dude. I was just said like, yeah, we gotta wait for the next Star Trek movie for it to get any love from Ubisoft. It's crazy. It's a very good game. It's scuffed as fuck, but like, really fun. Oh, dude. The, the, the struggle to draw a circle has begun. The only person I know who draws amazing circles first try, every time, Jaden. I don't know what it is about her, she can just fucking draw a circle like it's nobody's business. When we were on tour, she would just draw a circle, and we'd just like, huh? How are you doing that? It's fucking insane. Cause she ain't no square. I think it's because she, her, her character is literally just a circle. <laughs> I think when you draw a character that many times, you get really good at drawing just circles. <sighs> How much time we got? 640. Oh, what am I doing? And then they've got the little things at the top. Hello. It's six for me? Yeah, dude, I haven't slept yet. I'm fucking tired. I've wanted to draw Pura, so I figured before a Nintendo Direct was like a good opportunity to do that. Figured I'd sketch it. Good morning, big man. Good morning to you, crack wiper. Or wipe for. Uh. Yeah, good morning, guys. Um, we are coming up to 15 minutes out. I'll just get as much as this sketch done, because I just, I don't know. It's been a while since I just doodled something on stream for the sake of doodling something on stream. This is very wonky, the glasses, but I can fix them later. And then she's got the... Like this thing? How the hell does that work? It's like this. 
They're supposed to be goggles. I'll just get the basic shape down. There's like a antenna in the middle. Kind of dealio. And then she's got a little boop. And they got like sleepy eyes on the on the thing. It looks like a beret. Like without without the details, it really does. Something like this. Oh, I can obviously like spend more time on on the goggles later. Looks like a wind-up key. Yeah, it does a little bit, huh? She's got like a collar that like comes down like this and then kind of connects here. She also has giant bazongas so I'll do my best to to, to to capture that essence for you chat um hello this is my first time watching your streams I'm only here to say hi I'll be back later love your YouTube videos hey thanks Mark cheers man um yeah 15 ish out she does not <laughs> Well then, why does all the art online say otherwise? Bigger boobs mean more power. True. Oh shit, he's doing it! Y'all need Jesus. Nah, dog. I don't need Jesus. Tomodachi Life Summoning Circle. Dude. It is interesting how much people want another Tomodachi life. I want another Metopia. I get I get the 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 want for it, but like I want another Metopia.
Amitopia without taking away your companions every level. I mean, I kind of liked that about it, actually. The uh, friend lock fucking thing that I did was very fun because of that. I say friend lock because I don't really know what else to call it. Oops, that should have actually been out further, but whatever, I can fix that later. What's up, Bacon? How you doing, man? I hope your uh, your much needed vacay is uh, going well, dude. Hey, Russ, will you stream on Friday? I don't think I'm streaming on Friday. I normally stream Sundays. This is a rarity because of Nintendo Direct. Thus the uh, the me up early drawing uh, big anime titties. Best way to start the day. I agree, dude. got a bun actually i didn't realize the bun is behind is behind the the thing oh i missed her bun i got it i got i got ahead of myself chat i got ahead of myself you catch my drift should i make her head a little smaller just a smidge Kodachi life would be sick, guys. Ten minutes, by the way. I love the, uh, the fan thing of having her little, like, her little coat kind of, like, hanging down a little bit more than it, it normally is. So it kind of has this, like, you know what I mean? That shit's hot. Love it. Fucking love it. She's like fucking a hundred and something, right? She's based. She's she's kind of a gilf, right? She's kind of a gilf. No, yes. Am I right? It's the last look they'll get. No, but she was like, she like, she, doesn't she been around for a long time? Cause she like fucked with her, the, her own like. This time, he tries to outrun the police rather than just. She's like a hundred and thirty, cause she went back then forward. So she's like 150 something, right? Technically, I think everyone in in, in that game is a hundred somehow. Yeah. 
man. Being able to draw, guys. Worth it. Learn. How are we on time? Nearly there. Learn to draw so you can draw hot people. <laughs> yeah, that was my motivation all along. For real. I need to get like really good reference of the, the goggles here, but this is kind of sick. Obviously I'm just kind of like free balling it a little bit here. I haven't really. The outfit's kind of confusing. It actually goes down much lower than I, I thought. Six minutes? Yeah, six minutes, you're right. Well, chat, did we enjoy killing time watching Ross draw? I'm gonna do that later. Well, actually, no, I should save it now. Hold on, I'll do this now. Here, there we go. Beautiful. Yippee! All right, well, this is as far as I got before Nintendo Direct starts. There you go. I think I'm pretty happy with that. All right, uh, let me just switch over to camera. Kill the music. Boom. All right, let me get the fucking direct up. Oh my God, dude. Good morning, chat. How are we? Wait, where the fuck is the direct? Oh, here it is. Hua. Okay, direct is up. Let me change back. Uh. Oh, <laughs> hi, Pura. How are you doing? Hey, you come here often? Pissing alone, handsome? Watching Nintendo Direct alone, handsome? Cute, real cute. Uh, anyway, I gotta close that capture one sec. Let's get rid of that. Boom, there we go. Oh man, all right, Nintendy time. Nintendy time, guys. Yeah, it's, 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 it's ready. Any predictions? Mario, Mario. I might need to tilt my camera down more. My chair is really low today. I might just, actually, maybe I'll just make my chair back up. There we go, easy. I think I'm gonna take a nap over there after this. Why does everyone think we're getting a new Tomodachi Life? Was there a leak? Or is it just like... Like... Did, was there a leak? Or was there just like... Or just everybody wants it? I mean, I... I like Tomodachi Life. I thought it was funny. I just thought the Miitopia kind of trumped it. Like, you know, it was like so much better. But... I don't know. They're announcing Minecraft too. That'd be crazy. 
DLC for Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah. I mean, that'd be cool. Will they, though? It's a bit early. Oh, Pokemon DLC. Yeah, I guess it has been, it has been a while since we had Pokemon anything, right? I don't think we'll get Tears of the Kingdom DLC. I think it's too early. I still haven't even beaten it. I've been so busy, I haven't really had a chance to sit down and play. Twilight Princess and Wind Waker. Was there not... remakes of those already? At least Wind Waker, I know, right? DM me photos of the trip when you can. Badass, dude. Yeah, I want to see pics of the con. Diddy Kong Racing 2. Could they make that? I thought that was a rare game. They're owned by Microsoft. Crimson Yo, thank you. Thank you for the tier one, dude. Man. Imagine if they announced the new console. I guess this is like E3. This is basically E3. And I remember that because my birthday is always around E3. So, I guess if you're going to announce a console, this is where you do it, but I just don't think that it'd be cool. Happy birthday. I was burned my birthday on the 17th. Hmm. Ha! Alvarez playing Tomodachi Life and making all friends. Yeah, back in Grump's days, I made all, all the Grump, like... Oh, shit, the phone's going off. Made all the Grump heads, but because of how they were built, if any of them had children with each other, it just created an abomination because, it, like, the mouth was in between the eyes. It was just freaky. It was really funny. Hmm. All right, here we go. Let me know if the sound... Am I... Am I too quiet or am I too loud? You can hear it, right? Sounds good? Awesome. Pokemon. It's kind of low resolution. I think, I think uh, sorry, one sec. Yep. Sorry about that. Looks like it tried to default to 360. These were already announced. We're just probably getting details on them. It's Donkey Kong Island. Why is Pokemon on this Direct? They have their own Direct. Because it sells consoles. Okay. Oh my god, can we finally change outfits? Dude, there was nothing less cool than being forced to wear school uniforms for the entire game. That shit was so fucking annoying, dude. Ooh, 
That's a that's a funny looking guy. Oh, it's the monkey. A monkey mask? Monkey guy? I don't know. This is like that, that research facility in Sun and Moon. You remember that one? That was out at sea? I remember, what was that facility called? Ava Foundation, that's right, yeah. Dude, I actually, there's some story stuff I loved in Sun and Moon. People shit on it, but there's a lot of it I enjoyed. Is this going to be a video on your YouTube channel? Um, it'll be on the VOD channel. That's a definite. So hi, VOD, what, VOD watchers. Okay. Ooh, pretty. Wait, that thing's got a shell with all the types on it. Wait, why are all the types on that shell? Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be one of your guides for today's Nintendo Direct. Sup? I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll also be joining today. That was the latest trailer for The Hidden Treasure of Area Zero, the paid DLC for the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. The first half of the trailer took place at a festival in the countryside. Who would get masks? While the second half seemed to be in a completely different location, a futuristic academy in the middle of the ocean. More details on this DLC will be available in the future. I don't know if I beat... And after today's no, Nintendo I did. Direct, I did. a special I event will be held in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. We hope you'll participate in it. No, probably not. Okay, let's see our first batch of headlines. Sonic. It's a supersonic squad of superstars. Sonic and friends are spin dashing into a brand new 2D side scrolling game, Sonic Superstars. Well, 12 brand new zones await. Speed through beautiful worlds as Sonic. I don't know how Tales I feel about this one yet. As Tails. This one's Scale like walls and glide as The fact knuckles. this four player gives me four real Kirby vibes. Powerful hammer which is Amy Rose. You know, cool. By harnessing the incredible power of the Chaos Emeralds, you can summon a storm of clones. I just hope that the uh, four-player mode is online. Uncover hidden secrets. And so much more. And for the first time in the series, local co-op is available uh, for its a four-player. local? Dude, who has friends over at their house? Combine I sure your powers and take on the evil Dr. Eggman. That's such when a bummer. Sonic Superstars launches on the Nintendo Switch system Man, only this local? fall. Ooh. Yikes, dude. A cozy life That's is not just great. around the corner. Welcome to Palea. In this free-to-play adventure sim, create the idyllic Wait, life of your dreams. I saw this game in-game characters and players from ago. all over this the world. This is on PC as well, I think, right? Build houses. Decorate like some ex, your home plot, is this the one for the X Wow devs in your garden and more. Play with other residents in I online co-op or this with carve another out one. your blissful life Listen, solo. A and lot if you're of eager to explore, the games, there's I plenty of life beyond the village. And a Set game that can let me fish journey to uncover Palea's many mysteries. Or just kick back and relax at home. How you live is entirely up to you. What kind of coziness will you choose? Palea is free to play and launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. Okay. Ignite your heart. The Phantom Thieves return in this, this tactical like spin-off of Mario and the Rabbids. 5. Or when the group ends up in an unfamiliar persona? world. 
they must join forces with a revolutionary named Arena to combat the armies that have taken control. Like they've done before. Like a during battle, assess the situation and like determine a, whether to unleash an attack this, up close. I know it's already turn-based. What do you call or this? Using a persona. What kind of combat. Knock tactics. Down yeah, I guess it's persona by tactics. Called one more. Then surround tactics your game. foes That's, and yeah. take them out with dramatic like flair tactics. using the new all-out attack, Triple Threat. Fire Emblem. Yeah, I guess that's true. The fusion ability from the Persona series yeah, returns, allowing you to combine I don't mind this kind of combat, though, obviously. Ones. What is Arena's I'm very excited for uh, Baldur's Gate 3. I played the demo back when they first released it, and I was like, I'm not touching this game until it comes out. That shit was incredible. Nintendo Switch, November 17th. That comes out in August. I'm super excited for that one. Probably play it on stream with Kiwi. Today. Please check your local retailers. No, I'm not going to a retailer. Step into a Saturday morning cartoon. Calling all heroes for the first-person roguelike adventure, Myth Force. Oh. Enter a high fantasy world it's inspired like cartoony, by Saturday morning dungeon. cartoons of the past. Weird. It's up to you to stop the evil Daedalus from taking over, but it won't be easy. Treacherous tombs and cryptic Doesn't castles it? threaten it's your like survival. It's like He-Man meets Darkest Wield Dungeon. Wield medieval weapons and legendary magic to smite hordes of monsters. During each run, you can find treasure to help boost your character's abilities, weapons, and more. Plus, Let's play roguelikes. Four brave heroes I don't know if I played many other than Children of Morda. Drop in and out at any time as you face the many perils ahead. By the power of teamwork. <laughs> Myth Force launches on the Nintendo Switch system this year. This Black Fest is going to be pretty sweet. Oh. What are the topics going to be? The next Splatfest. You know, I Splatoon still haven't played been Splatoon 3. Okay, and the Squeeze, reason for it is really the dumb. Which flavor of ice cream is best? Vanilla, mint. strawberry, mint chip. or mint chip? Mint chip. People don't this understand mint chip has been underdeveloped the palate. The they say it screen. tastes like toothpaste. I was just like, I don't know what to tell you. Mm, you have an underdeveloped palate. Are delicious. No chocolate? Guide your favorite flavor to victory. Colgate has opinion. Plus, get splatting in themed battles with challenges. Yeah, the reason I've played more Splatoon 3 is because when it came out, people kept tweeting at me screenshots being like, I think I just played with you. And it's Rubber Ross Germa <laughs> and Markiplier. So someone took my username before I could buy the game. I was like, out of spite, I was like, I'm not, I'm not playing it. An even stronger bond between the people and Pokemon of Rhyme City. You played with them? Ha ha ha. Yeah, I know. I the amount of times day, I've seen people screenshot that shit and send it to me, I'm like, it's Tim not me. Pikachu. Yo, that's me. You two are the ideal the detective fuck, that's duo. me. That's crazy. That's literally me. Disguises are a key part of detective work. Quit goofing off and investigate. Ah, so much for my coffee. Something tells me this is just the beginning. A light roast today, huh? He's gonna fuck that growl up. There is something the two of you must know. You, you too. too! Based on our deductions, the culprit is clear, isn't it? Uh, a bolt of brilliance! The name's Pikachu. And I'm what you might call a, a great detective. Yeah. I sure wish somebody would bring me some coffee. <laughs> that was Detective oh, Pikachu God. Returns. <laughs> Looks like he still loves coffee. What cases will Tim and this tough-talking Pikachu solve together? More info will be revealed in the future. Not Ryan Next, Reynolds. Yeah, I don't think he was look free, guys.
Wait, is this Super Mario RPG? I never got to play this. It never came out in Australia. Is it a remake? No way, bro. That's crazy, dude. Oh my god, people are gonna be going wild for this. Oh, that's so cute! Look at him! No way, bro. I've Okay, so I've always wanted to play this game. For some reason, it never came to PAL regions. So Australia didn't get it. So I never got to play this, I never got to play Chrono Trigger, some amazing games. Never made it to Australia, and this is one of them. So Gino, people are gonna be excited about that, right? Wow, a fucking remake, dude. I like the style, I think it looks really cute. Oh, it's Gino, my god. Dude. People are gonna be going wild for this. This must have taken a long time to remake, too. It's a pretty big game, right? Am I not- is- like, how many hours was the original? Does anyone know? Wow. There he is. Oh, wow! Originally released on Super NES, Super Mario RPG returns with brand new graphics. Whether you played the original game or not, why not take the opportunity to jump into the very first RPG in the Mario series? I would, I would love to finally play this. Mr. Koizumi, that last trailer featured Mario, but he's not the only one getting a game. Huh? What do you mean? Let's take a peek. Peach is getting a game? Wait, is this a sequel to the... That's right. The Princess Peach will star as the main character in a brand new game. When Does she, she still fight with her emotions? Spot on stage. Huh? Oh. Whoa. What on earth is happening? That's all we'll show for now. Probably something we'll that's gonna start a new internet meme. Like, how's that? Day. Mr. Koizumi. There's actually something else. What? Yippers. Yeah. Oh, you like Mario? A visually enhanced version of Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, originally released on Nintendo 3DS, is in development. We hope you look forward to seeing more of Luigi's ghostly antics. Cool. Both games will launch next year. Mario. Badass. Princess Peach. And Luigi. But we're getting. Looks like Mario fans have a lot of games to look forward to. Fucking. More details will be shared in the future. Mario RPG. All right, Mario let's RPG. see some like, more headlines. Soon, technically. It's crazy. Become it's Batman. Gotham City's ultimate protector. It's Batman. Wake up, Mr. Wayne. We Mr. Have much Wayne. to discuss. I want you to know the fear that is coming. I've actually never this played any of the games. Of the I actually like you, DC, Dark but I've Knight. never played a Dark Knight game. You're all going down. You still know how to make an entrance. Welcome to the Madhouse, Batman! Is this a remake? Today is the Joker's big homecoming, and you're the guest of honor! Soon I will command forces yes, beyond which is your to explode. True. I've waited long enough. Batman dies tonight. I was born by the 10 FPS. Molded by it. I like it. Gotham would be ours. Over my dead body. I believe that was the idea. <laughs> Well, of course, Mark Hamill's a remake. They're just using the same 
voices. Don't be a stranger. You're always welcome here. Batman Arkham Trilogy launches on Nintendo Switch this fall. Cool. Play your cards right, mercenary. Lead your mercenaries through cursed dungeons in the lands of Gloomhaven. Your tactical prowess is all that stands between riches and certain death. This adaptation of the hit board game features turn-based card battles with RPG elements. Uh. Unleash deadly combos yeah, Kevin and Conroy. bring doom upon your foes. Rest in peace. But it's beware, gonna be hard to replace. exhaustion is close at hand. Absolute Choose from legend. 17 different mercenaries, brave over 260 grueling missions, and master over 1,000 abilities. Hone your deck, set up synergies, and gain every advantage to away, survive. Dude. Grit your teeth and earn your keep when Gloomhaven launches on the Nintendo Switch system September 18th. Pre-orders for the Mercenaries and Gold Editions begin today on Nintendo eShop. Keep the dance party going. At least my nephews and my niece will like this. Time for bad news, no time for bad news, just stop overthinking. Uh, uh, where's that? Uh, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't want to DMCA the VOD for just dance. Uh, uh, no, no, I don't think there's a single person in this entire chat that gives a shit. Um, oh yeah, our pirate's life for me, her. Uh, okay, is it done yet? This is this is just how it be, dude. One month free trial. Yippee. Wow, look at all those songs that could have got me demonetized. That's crazy. A silent hope. Oh shit. No, 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 Words. no, no, no. Oh, no. Sorry. One day, a once peaceful realm was silenced by its king. Now, seven wordless warriors will rise. In this wordless action warriors? RPG. These heroes bound by fate must work together to explore the abyss and find the secluded king. Zelda did it. However, with its ever-changing dungeons and powerful foes, conquering the abyss will be no easy feat. Wield weapons like swords, bows, magic, and more to survive this deadly chasm. It looks cute. After you return to base, Materials you collected will help you cultivate resources and forge new items. It's a farming game. Repeated forays into the abyss game. will enable you to grow stronger and so die That is a harvest moon cow. Can you Looks hear cute me? though. Your guide on this journey is the kingdom's sorrowful princess encased in a crystal of her own tears. And through a mysterious power, her voice reverberates in the hearts of the silent warriors. Why did the king steal the world's words? And what awaits the warriors in the depths of the Can abyss? Can they not talk? Silent Hope dives onto Nintendo Switch October 3rd. Yeah, the chibi an anime art style is cute. Sparks Agreed. will fly in these Nintendo Switch games. Cast spells and cultivate your best life in Fae Farm. Make use of magic to complete tasks and fend off mischievous foes. Enrich your farm wow, to help your character farm. flourish. Decorate Damn, your space to improve your stats for the day ahead. What concerned ape did? And enchant your friends locally Everyone or online in four-player co-op. They were concerned ape. Faith farm launches starter. as a console exclusive on Nintendo Everyone. Switch September eighth. Pre-orders, including some, an in-game bonus, are some available of the new now farming on games Nintendo are eShop. Pretty good. There was one that uh, Zoom Quay was talking about. Wild racing action with Hot Wheels Unleashed Two Turbocharged. My Sims? Oh yeah, I remember my Sims. Over 30 vehicles and pull off outrageous stunts Wait, to avoid hot, obstacles. Hot Wheels? Find shortcuts. Bacon would love this. And knock your rivals out of the way. Unleash your creativity oh, yeah. by Bacon, modifying you're your love vehicles this. and building your you own hear? tracks. Race locally with friends in split-screen co-op. 
Plus, up to 12 players can hit the track online. Grab the wheel when this game speeds onto the Nintendo Switch system October 19th. That looks like a mobile game that might Get my your chassis plays. looking classy in Manic Mechanics. It, the port of it. Grab a part, fix it up, and toss it over. Repair vehicles quickly to earn points in like, solo it, play. It looks like that or cooking game. Co -op. You know the the. But watch the, out the, for treacherous pits, the you know the one I'm talking UFOs, about and other it's workplace just that, hazards. Mechanics? Manic Mechanics launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch July 13. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Yeah. Introducing the second paid DLC for Mario Plus Rabbids Sparks of Hope. There was a first DLC. Mario and friends journey to a musical planet. Filled with new areas to explore. Ooh, you know why that could be good? Because Frank Kirkup does music for this game. What so else a musical will they find in this world of melodies? Right? Hopefully. This new DLC, The Last Spark Hunter, launches later today. A demo of the main game is available now on Nintendo eShop. Monsters! You really think you stand a chance against us? It's very Toriyama. Oh, because it is. It's it's fucking god. Uh, it's Dragon Quest. There you go. You intend to take arms against me? Very well. <laughs> you are I actually like Dragon Quest Builders. Dragon Quest Builders 2 is really cool. You're going to have to become a monster wrangler. No way. Dragon Quest Pokemon? Oh shit. This actually might be fun. It's like Persona Pokemon. Dragon Quest Pokemon actually sounds fucking cool. Ah, the so called hero is here. Okay. Could be fun. That was Dragon Quest Monsters, the Dark Prince from Square Enix. What kind of journey will you take to become the master of monster kind? Please be on the lookout for more info in the future. Next, we have more news on a certain game with plant-like creatures. Pikmin. Welcome to the Rescue Corps. As its newest recruit, you'll venture to a mysterious planet with all sorts of life forms. I'll there, try. You'll yeah. meet plant-like creatures called Pikmin. And the adorable rescue pup, Ochi. Come on, Oh, oh Ochi's so you cute. To accept it, repair the damaged Rescue Corps spaceship and save any castaways you find. All I right, really like let's Ochi. Explore that is a cute together. little guy. <clears throat> Once plucked, Pikmin are ready for action. Blow your whistle to gather them. Also, we know there's custom characters, so which is kind of cool. Throw your little buds at things, and they'll start working for you. Ochi will also prove to be a great canine companion. He can carry items with Pikmin, or smash obstacles in your way. And if you need a flotation can you device. Pet him? Well, can you pet the there dog? There you go. Ochi That's can even stand up to the wildest creatures. Collect lots of treasures scattered Ooh. around the planet to fix the spaceship's radar and open up new areas to explore. Exploration isn't limited to the surface, though. Why not take the plunge underground? Oh. Here, a completely different environment awaits. Unusual contraptions. That's kind of cool. Native creatures. 
and even more treasures are around every corner. You might unexpectedly find some castaways, too. Are they like other players? That died? Hey, it might be other players minute. who failed or something. This leafy individual just nabbed the castaway. You've got to stop him. What the heck? It's time for a Dandori battle. Embrace the art of Dandori it, by maybe, strategically issuing commands to your Pikmin like and Ochi. Collect like, more objects than your Olimar, opponent within the time limit like to win man. and save the castaway. By rescuing castaways, you'll be able to do more activities back at base camp, which is right next to your spaceship. Train Ochi and teach him new skills. Or build new equipment and items to help make exploration more manageable. For the first time in the oh. Pikmin series, you can eventually set out for night expeditions. Ooh. But there's a catch. Nightfall sends creatures into a frenzy, so stay alert. Like Minecraft. Thankfully, you'll come across the new Glow Pikmin, which only appear at night. Oh, that's super cute. They remind me of those Find little guys. Find luminols that the, produce the, um, valuable glow sap. These mounds also Princess attract Mononoke. various wildlife. You know the little so rattling use glow guys. Pikmin to drive them away and protect the luminols. Forest sprites, yeah. That's so cool. Many more surprises await on this uncharted planet. But with the Pikmin and Ochi by your side, Ooh, cool no scorpion. challenge is too big or too small. They're called the Kodama? Pikmin I love those little four. guys. I always forget what they're called. In past Pikmin games, you had to return to your spaceship before sundown. However, in this latest entry, you can now venture out at night. We hope you can lead the Pikmin on your expedition. We have even more Pikmin news to share. HD versions of the first two Pikmin games originally oh. released on Nintendo GameCube will launch on Nintendo eShop later today. Oh! Plus, ahead of the game's cool. release, a demo of Pikmin 4 will be available on Nintendo eShop on June 28th. The demo can be enjoyed even if you've never played a game in the Pikmin series before, so we hope you'll try it out when it releases. Okay, let's see a few more headlines. The renowned series of stealth action games is infiltrating Nintendo Switch as Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume 1. This compilation Just includes maybe they'd have a deal Metal package. Gear Solid, Infiltrate and Regain Control of Shadow Moses Island, Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty, Locate the first and retrieve a deadly Metal Gear Solid game I weapon. ever played Metal was Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater. Four. Survive the jungle and confront your new the mentor. whole lot because of you all my friends. You can also enjoy the games that started the series. Parodies. Metal Gear and Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake. As well as the NES versions of both Metal Gear and Snake's Revenge. This compilation also contains the first Metal Gear Solid digital graphic novel and its sequel. Additional content includes screenplay books and master books with story and character info, strategy guides for each game, and a digital soundtrack. Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume 1 launches on Nintendo Switch October 24th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Okay. The first three Metal Gear Solid games will also be available separately on Nintendo eShop. It's time to survive. Castlevania? Steal oh. thyself. Vampire Survivors is coming to Nintendo no, Switch. It's... Oh, that makes sense. You have what it takes to survive a 30-minute onslaught of monsters. Stay on the move fun. to avoid enemies and attack automatically with your weapons. Seems easy at first, right? But swarms of increasingly stronger monsters will appear the longer you survive. 
by getting treasure chests from defeated enemies or by leveling up. You'll acquire weapons and upgrades for your character, so shape them as you oh, see fit. This will be a fun game to have on Switch. Plus, up to four players can now play together <sighs> in couch co-op. What other horrors lie in store? Find out when Vampire Survivors launches on the Nintendo Switch system, August 17th. Music and pigeons? Sounds pretty cool. You're a pigeon. Yeah, you heard that right. Play online in this rhythm battle royale and aim to be the last bird standing. Hey, Up to 30 this. players can ruffle each other's feathers in musical mini games. Copy the leader's actions perfectly in Oh, it's, like, it's, Commander. it's, it's like a... A party game. Fire a slingshot to play music in first piano shooter. Rhythm battle royale. Oh my god, I get Race eliminated so fast. Race and fly to the rhythm dude. in to the sky and more. I would With suck over at this. 20 mini games, you're in for an impeccably good time. Get ready to shake those pigeon tails when Headbangers Rhythm Royale bops its way onto Nintendo Switch October 31st. Ready, set, yo! Penny is on the run. Oh, that's Tangled actually cute. in a chaotic audition that veered way off script, she's managed to make some powerful enemies and a newly animated friend. In this 3D platforming adventure oh, from the man. team behind Sonic Mania, you'll explore the bright and colorful world of Oh, wait, of Sonic Macaroon Mania team made this? And help Penny and Yo-Yo escape the clutches of the grouchy Emperor Eddie. Perform stylish acrobatic tricks Honestly, to avoid any really massive cute. horde of pushy penguins. And power up Yo Yo to protect Penny wow. from foul play. Am I? You can also put your speed running skills to the test in time attack mode. Am I crazy or does this look items, like really cool? Complete secret stages and more. This is your big break, after all. Take the stage when Penny's big breakaway launches on Nintendo oh, yeah, Switch that looks neat. early next year. That's surprising. Rev up for wave five. Ooh, maybe a new character? Funky Kong, maybe? A brand new course is racing into wave five of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. Introducing Squeaky Clean Sprint. More characters are also Wow, they finally uh, found a way to Mario give gamers Kart a bath. That's crazy. Piranha. It's the kind of innovation from I expect from Nintendo, to be honest with Wiggler. you. And from Mario Kart Tour, Comet. Oh my god, Comet. Wasn't he originally going to be in the N64, Wave but they cut five him? Wave 5 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game zooms onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Where's Goku? Oh, Active he's coming, Nintendo dude. Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Two worlds, one fateful encounter. A remake of the second Star Ocean game, complete with new graphics that I fuse 2D and 3D, game. is on the way. After a mission I goes like wrong, Federation Officer D Claw style, is stranded though. on an undeveloped planet. There, he meets Reyna, who possesses mystical powers. Was it fate or mere coincidence? Soon after, the two get entangled in a sinister plot within the galaxy. Wow, it's completely voice acted? In this science fantasy RPG, select either Claude or Reyna as your hero and play through the story from their perspective. Oh. You'll also meet so over a dozen potential allies from all walks of life. During your adventure, the hero you chose and the oh. decisions you make will have an impact on who can be recruited to your cause. The enemy is Battles take place in real time and skills can be oh, performed cool. with a single button. Play, New combat features in this remake include stunning enemies with chain attacks and having allies not in your current party unleash follow-up attacks. Letting you map out strategic battles Real in your time favor. Real time is not what I would expect from this. As I thought it was going to be turn based home, for sure. An ancient prophecy will unfold, and your but destiny like will be it. awakened. It's, Save it's... the planet in Star Ocean: The Second Story R, cool. launching on Nintendo Switch November second. 
It's time one, night, to night, move it Wario style. Get ready for more micro game mayhem in the latest WarioWare game. Oh, that one looks sus. Hold two Joy-Con controllers, then action. Move your body to take on a flurry of lightning fast micro games. What you do and how you move depends on the micro game. React quickly with the right movement and you'll be on the road oh, to cool. victory. Excellent! If you've got two pairs of controllers, play with a friend in local co-op. Sync These games are really to fun. Beat each micro game. Plus, up to four players can live it up across various mini games in party mode. For example, this dicey board game is going to keep you on your toes. <laughs> Get your body moving in over 200 lightning fast micro games. Yeah, I love these goofy ass games. In WarioWare, move it. Launching on the Nintendo Switch system November. That 3rd. looks fun. That looks fun. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Yeah. Damn, he's Why caked aren't you up. Saying anything? He was so into it, I didn't want to interrupt. Anyway, this is the latest WarioWare game. You'll use your entire body to strike different poses and complete micro games. We have a few more things to share. Families can join the fun at Nintendo Live 2023. Play games, enjoy live performances. Oh, Take Nintendo's doing their own characters and more. Cause they ain't Plus, got each cheer on your favorite players in Family team championships. Now. Eligible attendees can also compete in on-site tournaments and participate in oh. a last chance qualifier. And don't you dare this run a, a, a celebration. Don't you dare run your own tournament. Will take place September 1st through 4th in Seattle, Washington. Registration for Nintendo Live 2023 ends June 22nd. Head over to the official website and Don't enter the it. random drawing for a chance to receive tickets. PAX West badge holders interested in attending can visit the official PAX West website for more details. Those not selected will have another chance to attend with the three Challenge Cups this summer. The top 10 players from each will get tickets. Please visit the official website for more details. See you there. Is anyone here going to compete? Players are enjoying their time in Hyrule yes. in the Legend of Zelda I am. Tears of the Kingdom, which released last month. I found out if you put a bunch of cooking Thank things you all stacked very up, much. it's like a floppy penis. And you stick it to stuff. An amiibo figure of Link from the game was released to coincide with the game's launch. Ah. New amiibo of Zelda Ooh, and Ganondorf cute. are planned to be released this holiday. We hope you're looking forward to them. I guess. What do you get? Okay, this next segment will be our last announcement. Please take okay, a look. Okay, then I'm gonna go get some sleep before I got a meeting at 11.30. Ooh, what is that? Is that a fire flower? Onward and upward. Oh, it is, a new, it is a new 2D Mario game. But it's a new 2D Mario game, not a new, new, not a new Mario. You get what I mean. Well, it's not new Super Mario Brothers. This is a whole new thing. You can tell. Me. Hold on, hear them out. Let them cook. The Mario kind of looks like the covers of the the old um, Nintendo magazines. The like kind of clay look. Why does the music sound like Smooth McGrew? Is anyone else getting that vibe? I, I love this, guys. I, I think this is cool. And it, it, it gets me excited because, hey, maybe next Mario Maker they'll include this as a style. I like this. It's so weird. Great. Love it. Okay, other characters. Multiplayer, awesome. 
play this on stream with Gooey. Oh, no, no, no. Was that, it was four players, right? Yeah, it's four players. Oh, that's super cute. I actually love that. What's that? Wow, Zowie! That Goomba looks so so. Well then. Oh no, the porn. Oh no, the porn is gonna be uh, so fucking weird. Oh no. Super Mario Brothers. No. Wonder. No. When you touch a wonder flower, expect the unexpected. An elephant never forgets what happens when you give the fucking internet a new power up. Different, for example. That's gonna be weird, dude. There were also flowers talking. Daisy is playable. And Mario became an elephant at the end. Yeah, I saw. We'll share more details in the future, so we hope you'll look forward to it. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Oh my god. Why an elephant? Ugh. I, 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 they had me. They had me. They had me up to the elephant part. Ugh. Ugh. No, I don't like that. That's a... Uh... Mm -mm. No. Ugh. Elephants are cute? Yeah, but not like a furry elephant. Mario turning into a kind of furry... Ugh. Oh, God. I'm gonna go lie down. Cool direct.